warning! This video may not be suitable for all viewers. This content is aimed towards adults, and adults who are not easily triggered over harmless fiction, and knows how to separate harmless fiction from reality. We are not responsible for you getting triggered. You have been warned. Ooh -woo. What's up, everyone? It is I, the Video Game Hunter, and welcome to another unboxing video. And today, we are checking out something that's not video game related for once. But today, we're going to be unboxing something that's a bit more special. When I mean a bit more special, I am unboxing something that's completely anime related. That's right, folks. It's very rare that I get to do something something anime related here on this channel. And what I'm going to be unboxing is a special little anime show called Interspecies Reviewers Volume 1 Special Edition Blu-ray Set. And the website I actually bought this from was called Amy Amy, which is a Japanese exclusive website. And the thing about this website is that, um, even though this is actually the Blu-ray Special Edition, they decided to add something a little bit more extra to the pile. And that is a completely awesome statue. And I don't know how big the statue is. This might be a big box, but I don't expect the statue being that big. But the fact that it cost me a lot of money, not only for the item itself, but it cost me about, I don't know, 180 bucks, which is obviously completely expensive than the special edition we usually get here in the US. Which a Blu-ray set special edition here would be about 60 bucks. Over in Japan, uh, buying a Blu-ray is like buying a, a video game system over there. Yeah, I'm not joking and I've been to Japan. That's really how things are. But that said, um, enough mumbling around. Let's go and unbox what's in here. <laughs> There we go. Woo! Oh, wow. First, we get a thank you card. Oh, okay. Thank you for your continued support of Animal. Oh, Amy Amy. Why did I say Animal? Maybe because I'm, I have furries on my mind right now. Woo! You're welcome. Um... Well, here's the thing, this is actually my first time ordering it for guys, so it's not really right for me to, for you to say for continuing to support. This is literally my first time ordering from you guys. And we get another card. Aww. Thank you for shopping with us. Yes, you're quite welcome. Alright, so... Inside. Uh, that's just a cardboard for the packing. And we got the paper, and look, it's the statue. That's the first thing that pops up on right here. Oh no, the blue ray is attached to it. Oh, sweet. Look at that. Okay. Um, let me check there's nothing else in there. Uh, oh yeah, that's nothing but packing paper. They really packed this thing well. Damn. All right, so now let's go unbox you. All right, so there's the Blu-ray. It has nothing but hearts on there. Man, um, if I didn't know any better, it doesn't look like the interspecies reviewers all that much. Hmm, it might, it kind of looks like a completely different anime. And there we go, oh my gosh, there's going to be lots of censoring on here. Especially because of that cow. And the, the slime. I think everyone else is pretty much fine. Yeah, 
they're completely fine. Oh yeah, they're completely fine. Look how fine they look. Oh man. Gosh, I guess I'm going to be censoring some stuff in this video too. So it's like my Let's Plays. Alright, let's open the sucker up. We got... Oh. Look, I know that's not the real thing, but that... Man, that really comes close. Do I have to censor that? Do I have to censor that? That's really cutting it close. Oh, look, I'm just noticing the back. Oh, the back is very pretty. We only saw the front, but now we get to see the back. Yeah, mostly I'm just going to be censoring this area right here. The one on the back of the case. Oh, you look fine. I don't think there's any censorship I need to do. <laughs> nice. Oh, what's amazing is that this thing comes with a sound track. Now, I don't know much about most of the songs that was on the show, but the opening and the ending songs are downright amazing. People who I talk to especially love the opening. For whatever odd reason, it kind of reminds of YMCA. Ah, all right. So we looked at that and this, I'm not 100% sure what this is, but it has my little favorite hyena on the front cover. And to be completely honest, I just didn't think I was going to enjoy the hyena that much. Because right before the show was aired, I actually learned some animal stuff about a hyena and finding out that they have a pseudo penis. Yeah, we're not talking about the males. The females actually do have a pseudo penis. So you don't like, um, you know, a furry animal with something a little bit extra down there? Oh, uh, maybe she's not your cup of tea. But remember, she's a full-fledged female. <laughs> All right. And in here, we got, ooh, something very spicy. I can't really show that. And it looks like it's just showing a bunch of clips from the show. And there we go. That's all I was talking about right there. They even tell you in the show, hyenas do have a pseudo-penis. Nice. They, and they already censored it, so there's no point for me to show any. Though well, not show. There's no point for me to censor anything on that picture, because they do it for me. But the other pics, well, I'm going to have to censor that. <laughs> All right, and we get some characters art for each of the characters in the show. Um, you know, uh, the characters over here, they're the main characters you see reviewing the monsters. The characters on the left, they kind of come and go. <laughs> Whew, okay, let's put this away. It's kind of get a bit more spicy in here. All right, next we got is a, it looks like a, a short manga of the show. I don't know if this is the official volume one of the manga or a quick sample of it. Got a sense of that, what I saw, but this is actually pretty cool. Okay, maybe it's not a manga of the show. It just gives you a, a slight glimpse of it. Okay, so this is a this is basically a screenplay by panel by panel what they have to do, and censor. Oh, that's pretty neat. All right, and now let's look at this extra special edition they added to the set, the statue of Lo. She's you kind of say she's in business of being an. For, no, she's in business for being a prostitute and getting customers for her employees. Oh, by the way, if your dick is bigger than six inches, um, no fairy, no fairy girls for you. I don't think they can handle anything bigger than six inches. So guys, anyone who has uh, a dick longer than six inches, you should have luck. Gosh. Oh, they have tape on the bottom, okay. There's a piece of tape I gotta cut. Whew. Oh, it comes with pad. Okay. Let's open up the pad so we can put you on there. Oh, that's a nice 
Ooh, that feels really nice, not gonna lie. And we, I'm gonna assume it goes right there. It does not say, and there's no instructions that I can actually read to tell me how it goes on. Bill. Ooh. Oh yeah, this is a, this is an a, this is actually a legit statue. I am not gonna lie. This is not made of plastic. So in other words, I have to be completely careful where I put this. Um, I do not want this falling down. If this falls down, it's absolutely gonna break. <laughs> oh wow, so. Let's go and get, let me go get my camera and take a closer look at this. <laughs> look at that. Look at that. That is so cool. That might be a bit blurry. Let's fix it. There we go. Look at that. That is so cool. You know what? I think that this is the biggest statue that I have that has the biggest tits. Or maybe this might be the biggest tit statue I ever had. Oh, let's zoom in. Let's zoom in. And unblurry that. Yeah, I gotta adjust this. Oh, that's wonderful. Wonderful! Alright, let's put you back on the camera stand, shall we? Alright, so... That is my unboxing video. I will say this, I, <laughs> it probably won't surprise you guys, but it's most likely that I won't be watching this version of the Interspecies Reviewers. Um, Cause I don't think this has English subtitles. The really the main reason why I bought this set is because I highly doubt that we're ever gonna get an English version here in the US. Since this show is so controversial a lot of streaming service like Fun Animation decided to take the show down from the streaming service because it doesn't go but because it does not fit the so-called policies. But anyway, so really, I'm probably gonna be continuing watching the uncensored subtitle version online that's made by fans. That's probably the main one I'm gonna be watching. This one, like I said, probably won't have English subtitles, but. That said, um, thank you so much. If you guys haven't watched Interspecies Reviewers and you're a, a complete horn dog like I am, please check out the show. It's actually quite amusing. It's not all about sex, pervertedness. It actually has some humor in there. So that said, thank you so much for watching my video. This is the Video Game Hunter. And until next time, goodbye. I like to